you know what, why it was done? Bakit po? Oy, 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 oy! Ano nilipat yung isa? Oy! Oy! Our next bout is 10 rounds on the flyweight division. The fighter in the blue corner, wearing blue trunks, with a record of five wins, 19 defeats and two draws. He is from Aluman Sarangani, ladies and gentlemen. This is Ramil Antaran. His opponent in the red corner with the ARQ logo and red trunks. Weighing 113 pounds, he's got a record of four wins, two by way of knockout and no defeat. From ARQ Stable in Cebu City, please welcome Ramil Macado Jr. Mayong gabi, kaninyo na tanan. This is our co-main event of the evening. Neil Papa. You have here Ramel Antaran versus from ARQ Boxing Stable. Junjun Makado. Ramil Makado Jr. Again, one of the decorated ama amateur fighter here inside the ARQ Boxing Stable. Former Philippine team. Yep. Uh, just recently, a year ago, parang gusto niyang papasok sa professional uh, rank or level. Hello, uh, of course, yesterday uh, or the, before the weigh-in, I had an interview with uh, Ramil and uh, he has 200 plus fights in amateur. That's a lot of fights. And uh, th there's one thing that he said in the interview. I caught my... Uh, I mean, uh, what's that? 4-0. He said, 4-0. You'll be able to win the fight. Yes. I'm going to be a champion. I'm going to be a champion. Oh, oh, oh. 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 Traveling all over the world because yun nga ah, membro siya ng uh, Philippine team natin sa yep. boxing eh. The Battle of the Ramil pala to. Oh. Ramil and Ramil. <laughs> same, same first name. Junior lang itong si Makado but uh -huh. we are fond of calling him Junjun from Jensan. Round 1 scheduled for 10 rounds. Alam mo itong si uh, Ramil Antaran Tantaran, no? Oo, alam mo, pa, medyo pang haba to eh. Last two fights, umabot talaga siya ng desisyon. Kaya naman ang sinabi niya sa akin, hindi lang last two fights. Last six fights niya, puro ano, desisyon. Oo, oh, oh, nga pala, no? Saan talaga eight, nagtatrabaho eight, eight. to? Oo. Oh, putting really, you know, putting some time and effort, you know? That's what I like about, uh, you know, you can say, say that he's a journeyman, pero sabi niya, ginagawa ko yung trabaho ko. Exactly. I train, and when they call me to fight, I fight. So talagang lumalaban siya and uh, I expect nothing less uh, than for him to test the, itong si Makado. Exactly. Again, Makado wearing red trunks at for Antaran blue and white trunks. Alam ko, paborito niya na ito si Antaran eh. Kasi dalawang magkasunod. Uh, ARQ boys ang kinalaban niya. Yeah, April J. Abne. Yep, op April J. Abne and Berlin Robles. Robles. This year alone. Correct. So, it means na kahit pa pa, no? you, you see something na, oye, pwede to. Talagang lumalaban and worth the money. Oo, kasi na, you need more fights like this, eh. You know, quality fights. Especially itong Ramil Antaran, a journeyman, an experienced one. Hindi tumatakbo. Mm. You know, urong sulong. Pero hindi tumatakbo, hindi umaayaw. Yan ang gusto natin. Exactly. We want, yeah. we want a good fight, especially for the fans. And he's only 26 years old, by the way. Bata pa. Yes. Sa pangasa sinabi niya, kahit daw ang talo niya, ang dami niya, he still dream of becoming a world champion. Eh, eh kung wala siya doon, ano pang yung reason niya nandun, di ba? Uh, well, you know. <laughs> Na, may, may, meron talaga niya. No, there's a fighter in that guy. You know, putting every day, yung diet pa, yun yung mahirap doon. Ayun. Makado has that height and reach advantage. Good defense shown there by Antaran. Close fins. Agad eh. Clinch agad eh. Mm, nice work. Overhead right ah. Hindi na tumama but I like that move here for Antaran. Mm, pasok yun. 
sa na ito sa mga galing na kalaban si Romelu. Pero yung may nasa listahan niya, Abney, Jason Mama, Mayab in Jerusalem, Mark Anthony Bariga. May mga pangalan. Yes, sir. Alam yung babad sa lalo. Yeah, and guess what? Like what I said, went the distance. That's the end of the first round. Let's see some highlights here. Atatan versus Pagali. Ito na po yung ating uh, round number two. Someone uh, just saying na uh, ito daw si uh, Ramil eh, from Cotabato, Toronto City. Ito na round number two. Again, ito si Makato, ang ating uh, amateurista. White stand, south po position. And then of course, our fighter in the blue corner is Antaran. The Battle of the Ramels. Ramil and Ramel. So, siguro, no? um, um, as uh, itong si Antaran, nakakabot siya ng decision, it will be big for dito kay Makado just in case he can put down Antaran. Exactly. If he can. If he can. You know, marami pang mayayari. Scheduled for 10 rounds. We're now on our second round pa lang. Mm -hmm. Second round is to come in event, guys. Next na po. Huwag na po kayong aalis dyan. I know we have 1.2K. Uh, viewers right now, next na yung ating iniintay, ang pinakamaangas sa Cebu, John Paul Gabonilas versus the little giant Jesse Espinas. Oh, that's 108 pounds. Of pure, yep. yeah, pure, pure, pure boxing. Yes. Pure boxing, you know, aggressiveness, flamboyant, kumpiansa, yeah. lahat ng angas. For sure, you're gonna watch it later on. Good yeah. combination that time and aggressiveness Makado. for Makado. That's the first time I've seen this guy throwing some combinations. He yeah. needs more of that. Makado, what uh, you know, for for a boxer that has been fighting in the amateur, I'm always interested to see how he has the, can develop into a, a pro boxer. Yung style niya ba would he would be retaining the amateur style or? Kasi usually, pag amateur, yung score, score lang. You don't really need uh, a knockout. Let's see if we can uh, try. Because Hantaran is uh, making this really interesting. Oh, again, this is the challenge here for especially, you know, being playing for how long in the amateur level. Hantaran, good left hook earlier. Tumama, pero hindi lang masyadong uh, clean look. Good. Mm -hmm. Defense shown by Antaran. So far, itong si Antaran, maganda yung the way he clenched siya. Protecting his face and his chin. Yeah. He needs to do that against a uh, you know, very a skilled uh, amateur boxer like Makado. Ewan ko ba if Makado already experienced yung wala ng heat gear sa amateur? Parang I think kasi bago lang eh. Last year pala siya nag-amateur eh. O, oh, nag-professional pala. Maka naabutan. Maka naabutan, no? So, padang ano lang yan, reset nilang. Kaya yeah, mga 2018-19, if I'm not mistaken. Last 10 seconds of the second round. Do you know why it was done? Ba bakit po? Uy, 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 uy! Ang lumilipad yung isa! Uy! Uy! <laughs> Nasa ilalim yung isa. Nasa ibabaw yung isa. So, pag-aangat, yan talaga yung mangyayari. That's the end of our second round. And the people here inside San Fernando Sports Complex are starting to get alive. Yeah, importante talaga na may, may rock girl. 
banana. Yes, we're, we're seeing a lot of blood and fighting, so we need some uh, balance in life. The beauty and the badness. <laughs> <laughs> the fighting. Yeah, going back. Uh, before, kasi yung boxing, parang na sa amateur, nawawalan daw siya ng medyo viewership because the parang quite exciting because of the headgear that's why they removed it and they're really adapting kasi nga pinayagan na rin nila yung mga pro to fight oh, remember kasi that nga, you know in fairness yung pro fight to the one who's deciding it with the headgear yung vision mo mahirap pa that that one too plus ayun na nga pinayagan nila yung mga ano yung mga pro na to fight in the amateur rounds exactly third round scheduled for 10 Oh yeah, that is a 10-rounder, a home main event. Tight din yung defense ni Dede ni Antaran eh. Maganda rin yung... Yeah, so far so good. I like how he defended his body and his jaw here so far. Probably one of the reasons why he has never been knocked out. Yeah, and umaabot siya ng pa... Decision talaga. It's a good habit for a boxer, no? Uh, so he just need to improve on, on the probably his offense, uh, para siya na wala mga pagbabaksa. Oh. oh. <laughs> and uh, ito si Andran na yon ng medyo moving forward attacking. Both fighters here on the round. A I bit of afraid to exchange. Mm -hmm. See Makado looking to counter. He's been uh, backing up, backpedaling oh. for this fight. Especially yeah. this round. Counter mm -hmm. then. You know, oh, parang pasok yung uh, right hook doon ni Antaran. Ha? Hindi lang solid punch. Pero again, I think uh, pumasok yun. Oh, oh good. Na. Oh, na. Right overhand. Sabi ni Makado, shoulder lang yung na... <laughs> Makado now missing some shots. Marami kayo fighter dito sa ARQ. They have very good boxing skills. I gotta say this though, today, almost everyone has tried, uh, but hindi masyado maraming mga knockout eh. But the skills, I mean, you can see that talagang, ano, uh, improve. Talagang malaki yung skills. Matitibay lang talaga yung kalaboy, yung kiwit sa di Antaranton. Yeah, you know, talking about, you know, our fighters are getting, you know, fundamentally improved. Galing na trainer. Oo. Oh. Eh, madami na rin gumagaling na trainer din eh. Ah, uh, yes sir. Last 10 seconds. So far, wala pa talagang matinding nangyayari dito for both fighters. That's the end of our third round. Some highlights here. Again, in Cuento Uto, ARQ Sports. And here we're back to back the game. Can we use the board? Philippine flyweight champion yes, sir. against the current OPBF youth flyweight. I stand corrected. Akala 21, 22 years old na pala. Ah. Ito si Chad Paul. Well, ang angas ng Cebu. And oh, you know, the thing about uh, Cebu talaga, napapansin ko, uh, yung, ano nyo, yung viewership nyo, there's women, uh, there's uh, kids. Uh, na talagang ano eh, parang family-oriented yata yung boxing dito, hindi na siya panalaki. And you know, you need to give credit then kay Manny Pacquiao for bringing family 
Kasi, you know, it started with the Luis Luisito Espinosa. Yun yung nabutan ko eh. Uh -oh. Jerry, the Donaires, the Pacquiao's, Bobby and Manny. And then, you know, again, talking about nagiging zero crime rate nga eh. Oo, oh, grabe yan. Ang dami na pala nabutan ko. Kasi ako nabutan ko Gabonilas eh. Wow. Yung itas. <laughs> Parang mas may edad sa akin. <laughs> Uy, yun na. The overhand right hand ito ni Tito ni Antarana. Yep. Somehow, no? Has been successful so uh, somehow, far. Somehow, somehow. Maybe connected around 40 to 50% of the thrown punches yung overhand niya. Pero malakas ha. Malakas ha. This is around number 4, 1 minute and 45 na. No? Yep, Makado. Throwing some Good. wild left hook. Ayoy, <laughs> ayoy. Na ililik yung taso sa likod ha. Andre si Makado, very systematic din lumaban. No? Yeah, it, yun yung nabibigay ng amateur. Eh. Imagine mo, oh, good left hook there for Makado. Alam mo yung dami mo nang nare-receive na mga trainers all over the world. Yes. Pumunta ka pa ng Cuba. So, uh, you know, the different uh, techniques. Okay. Medyo namulamula na tong uh, left eye. <laughs> Pero mas matibay si Antara. Oh, matibay, matibay, matibay. Yeah. He's moving forward. He's not fighting, uh, finding Makado, but he's moving forward. He's, he keeps on trying. Magalaw to si Makado. Nice footwork, nice head movement in the comeback. The uh, papak, uh, kung baka, mga, ano yung mga punches niya, selection niya, okay naman eh. Yan. Makado should know, go to the body. Good fighters, not going to the body. They're just exchanging. Let's go now. Let's go. Oh, ne, sabi ni, ne, uh, I understand yun. Nilip-read ko. Sabi ni Antaran, kusga, alam mo yun? Lakasan mo. Kusga. <laughs> kusga. Ganun ba? Oo. Oh. Yan na, ganun. Uy! <laughs> <laughs>
Na, actually, nadadala si Antaran sa laro ni Makado eh. Laro ni Makado yan eh. Oh, he's getting uh, defensive here. Ay, boxing, boxing. Mahirapan siya pa ganyan. He oh. needs to try and force it in. Yeah, dapat papasok talaga siya. Try oh, to you know, get some exchange here. Eh, mabilis eh. Good combination that time for Makado. Wild punch for Antaran. Hindi pumasok. Y yun ang isang nakikita ko. I mean, he, he got the, the power in those hands. Pero he's not setting it up. Pinilit niya yung overhand niya. I mean, sometimes it works. But, you know, you gotta try and, you know, maybe use the jab first. Or maybe some fakes. Or go inside. Defend inside. And then combination. Make it an inside. Yeah, combination. Yep. Counter punch. Phone boot. Yun sinasabi ko yung tigitan niya. Tigitan niya, yeah. Kasi mukhang mid-range ang labanan nito. Tsaka long distance ang labanan niya. Ano yun? Makati yun. Oh, always. Yeah, ganyan. You know, stepping backwards. Si Makato kasi step backwards pero may pabaon. Antaran showing some antics here. Last 10 seconds. Lamil Makado versus Lamil Antaran. Oy. <laughs> That's the end of our sixth round. Or fifth round, rather. Let's see some highlights here. That's the start of our six. Six rounds. Six rounds scheduled for ten. Medyo kulang pa ng kisaw. No? Kisaw. Ano ba sabi nyo? Uh, kulang pa ng mga combination for both fighters. Wala pang masadong uh, alam mo yon mga hmm. brawl. Wala pang masadong mano imano. It's more of a defensive and it favors. Itong si Makado. Makado fights the distance, the mid-range, and yung mga long shot, long shot na ngayon. Si Antaran, mas maliit, obviously, tsaka sa style niya. He needs to do, he, if, he needs, if he wants to win, he needs to change right now, midway to the round. Yeah, change game plan. Kaya siguro nakaka, you know, nakatapos siya. Na, uh, every after fight for the last six fights that he had, I mean, he has shown that he has the kahit pa paano yung matiba yung kanyang ulo, yung chin uh, in his fights, no? Uh, but he needs to work his offense too. Yeah, kailangan din. Kailangan din. Sa so, larong boxing, kailangan mo ng opensa. Kailangan mo ng depensa. That's correct. Hindi pwedeng depensa lang. Hindi siya pa napapasok talaga eh. Again, because yung Makado kasi mautak rin eh, di ba? Pagpapasok siya, paatras, eh... Makado Jr., he has that height and reach advantage. So, kailangan gamitin niya. Mm. Yun na nga. And, hindi, hindi, ang ibig sabihin ko, hindi talaga maka-adjust yan. Tara. Ah, hindi talaga. Mahilap. Pag hindi siya papasok, ayaw niya isugal. So, again, easier said than done. Kita mo yung galaw. Oh. Ayan o. Oh. <laughs> Chain stance agad si Makado eh. <laughs> This is a, a frustrating fight if you're the smaller guy. He wants to make it a brawl. He can't. He wants to try and attack. Hangin ang inaaputan mo. Oh, yun yung mas nakakapagod. Punching in the air. Walang natatamaan. Our referee are urging both fighters to box it out. Uh, he's looking, you know, jab wala. Yo. Yung ikot si Makado. He's moving to the left, trying to stay away from that. He reset. And a jab. Wala. <laughs> Galing na po, mas straight na siya eh. Oo, oh, sabi mo nga kanina, mas nakakapagod yun, yung suntok sa hangit. Body shot. I think, ano, ang nangyayari kasi, you know, just uh, my point of view, 
bumibitaw sa labas pa lang itong si Antaran. Sa labas pa lang bumibitaw sa sudok. Eh, he needs to risk. Pasok na lang siya sa loob muna ng nakagay nito. Hintayin niya yung bumitaw, saka siya bumitaw ng madami. Yeah, kaya natin lang niya papasok. No, ang problema, hindi siya pumunta sa angle eh. He's always on that right side of Makado. Siguro eh, he needs to uh, accept a uh, 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 one or two punch and then go inside. And tik-tik niya sa, uh, ano, nasa gitna sila eh. That's not right. Kado Jr. is ready to mix it up. Seven na pala tayo? Oo, oh, seven na. Ganun kabilis. Walang masyadong nangyayari. You know, they need to entertain us. Not only us, but the people here. Again, pag, you know, ito yung game plan siguro ni Makado. I mean, assumingly talaga yan yung game plan niya because that game plan would give him the W. Yeah, it benefits him. Yes. Against the style of Antarano, no? Oo, oh, oh. So far, still Makado is still the aggressive one here. So far, an hour unofficial scorecard. Medyo lamang itong Makado. Yeah, he get uh, he has control of the fight uh, from round one to siguro uh, round number seven. There are a few moments of course by Antaran, pero not enough, siguro. Yeah, earlier on the round he landed that uh, right oh, overhand. Right pero pa isa isa lang eh. Hindi pa yung ganon eh na good one landed punch sa yun na yung round. Mm -hmm. It should be a consecutive, you know, being aggressive, consecutive, really commanding the ring. Yeah. So um, again, para sa akin dito, it's Antaran that needs to make the uh, make this uh, to a fight. Yeah, he, he needs to be more aggressive now. Don't wait. Yeah, Makat is just doing what what he needs to do. What he's good at. Yep. Maybe sabi siguro sa mga fans, come on, let's make it a brawl, let's make this a fight. But uh, ganyan ang style, eh, no? I mean, you gotta do what you get, need to do. For a win. For, for, for a win. Yeah, for, for, for a win. Right? You hate me, but you're still gonna watch me, and I'm gonna do what I'm good at. The problem is, uh, Antaran is not doing anything to to ignite the the fighter in, ano? The fighter in him. In, 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 and also, the fighter for, for in Makado. Makado. Kaya, Makado is just relax dalawa din thing. dalawa din yan eh baka he felt earlier the, pa the power of Makado baka sabi niya ay mabigat din suntok so you know wala you know <laughs> may ulipad bilis gumulaw eh nung wala ka agad sa yung, yung line no line of fire oo exactly good point there sa kaliwa ala, sa kaliwa ka agad eh And shout out mm. sa lahat ng Pilipina Super League personnel, of course. You know. Idol natin dyan, Alexander San Pablo. Ay, shout out sa'yo, sir. Oo, oh, and then, bagus pa ito sa pod. Kita ka's picture, bay. Bago na po din mong sandal. <laughs> Mayong gabi, eh, dila. Mayong gabi, eh. Kaya lang ba, pwede pa makapanood ako dyan sa Pilipina Super League? Wala, walang problema. Sa Manila? Oh. Kaya hanggang kailan pa yung liga doon? Hindi, uh, it's already started. Nasa Kaloocan. Everybody. 
We're just waiting now. Baka pwede kung papupuntahin tayo next year. Pwede. Yeah. Kasi wala na rin uh, season eh. Uh, Off-season namin eh. Ah, nice work. Parang gusto kong mag-try, mag-commentate sa basketball. Pwede. Practice lang yan, pare. Mga, ano, i-recommend mo ako isa lang pasubo? Oo, oh, walang problema. <laughs> anyway, baka sabihin ko, para tingnan na natin, baka may mag-away. Nandito na ako ready. <laughs> <laughs> Alam mo, pa mahirap na yung away-away ngayon because of the live streaming. Uh, Alam mo yun, napapahiya kasi. Pag... Maamores ka. Oo, di ba? Uh, anyway. <laughs> anyway, shout out to that guy. You know, he's apologized. Well, he's, he's, he has back. Yeah, Mayroon yeah. na siya team. Yeah, okay. sa Sabuang Gamalientes. Exactly. He was playing for the Asian Basketball League. Again, this is our eighth round. Antaran. Pagpasok lang ni Makado, automatic. Those fins clinching diretso eh. That. Alam mo, there, there are a lot of guys uh, in the Philippines na they have physically gifted uh, and they have talents, no? Uh, pati yung, ano nila, yung katawan nila. Oo. Oh. Pero, you know, the style and then yung technique ng kote, they just need to improve. Yeah, improve, exactly. So, yun, yun lang eh. Gaya nito ni Antaran, like, you know, he has a good uh, uh, body, maabot siya, pero... Medyo yung discarding niya dito kay Makado, hindi niya siya makapasok. Although, si Makado is winning this one. Sometimes it, it doesn't look pretty as well. I mean, just being honest with you, medyo yung mga sh shot niya, his landing, I expected a little bit more. Yeah, exactly. Oh, wild punch there. Again, yung right overhand niya talaga. That's parang yung go-to go punch niya. Yun na nga. Again, sa larong boxing, pwede makachamba, pero you need to be more consistent. Combination kailangan. Yeah, I mean, I mean yung mga ganong overhand punch, you know, if when when you ano, when you get hit by that, you know, you could probably go down, you could probably get knocked out, but it's like a lottery ticket. <laughs> it's like that. The probability is small. The probability is small, right? <laughs> right now, the referee are edging both fighters to fight. And then, agitated na rin yung mga tao. Oh, kasi alam mo naman yung tao dito eh. Gusto, they want blood. Si Puto eh. Ito nga yung gusto lang, bakbakan. <laughs> eh, mamaya siguro. I'm gonna, gonna put all my money where my mouth is. Siguro, gusto nyo yung entertainment? Go, main event natin. Sigurado yan. Yeah, well, Bakada is not to blame here. Uh, I mean, that's his style. But, you know, maybe he consider na rin na medyo change ng konti. Medyo mix it up a little bit just yep. for the fans. Yep. But, but for sure, mamaya, ang angas sa Cebu. Ayun, no, there's no yan. dull moment for that guy. Yeah. No dull fight. Even if he's not fighting, even if it's just the breaks. Ah. That's it, 10 seconds. Just don't go away, guys. Round number 8. Just uh, after this one, main event. Himself to be one of the best boxers here in the Philippines, just you know, also still a, a young boxer. Uh, so, you know, the story of a, a young lion and uh, and uh, still hungry lion is coming in the main event. Now, right now, it's the main event between Andran and uh, decorated the amateur, uh, itong si uh, Makado. Oh, of the former Philippine team member. For Philippine team. Oh, imagine mo, donning yes. the flags for the country for how many years? Yung eh. yung pandemic ang dami na change na tao eh. Ang dami talaga. Oh, pa Makado is one kasi nga sabi niya wala na ako pupuntahan. Might go as well, you know, go to change the tao, change the lives. 
change the direction. Oo. Again, one thing din nahihirapan itong si Antaran, he has that uh, short uh, reach. So, pagpapasok talaga siya, nahihirapan. Yeah, one thing that I would like to say, and this is positive for Antaran, ano, uh, some, some of the guys who say, uh, ano yan, hindi yan nananakot kasi he's just trying to survive. He's not trying to survive, he's trying to to go inside. He just couldn't. Yeah, mahirap. Kasi nga yeah, that, mo, gusto niya naman mga ipagpakbakan eh. Oh, so, Makado is fundamentally sound, especially on his defense. But that's a footwork. Uh, it's gonna be a frustrating night. Siguro, after nito ni, Ram, ni Ramin at Ran, di <laughs> mahirap mauli eh. You know, that, that gamesmanship of Makado, will you credit to his uh, illustrious amateur career, especially done in the Philippine flag? Mm. Kasi diba, you, you've gone to Cuban trainer, you've got a Mexican trainer, Asian trainer, yes. Philippine trainer. Imagine mo, if you get all the techniques. And ano uh, naman talaga, yung boxing is, uh, is a game of hit and not get hit. Di ba? So, uh, baka dos, <laughs> That's the hit. mantra of, yeah. of, of the Floyd Mayweather. Oh, yeah. I mean, it makes a lot of sense. I mean, after all, at the end of the day, you want to still be alive and 100% functioning. Yeah, you need to enjoy. Yep. Enjoy life at the end of the day. Not, not everyone likes it. Yep. Because especially mga Pinoy, galit na galit sa mga ganyan because we're Hindi used to... Hindi kasi eh. Hindi kasi ilabol eh. And then plus, we're used to our very own warrior, Manny Pacquiao. Oh, na, duguan. Come on, let's fight. Oh, yun, duguan. Let's fight. Come on. Patay kong patay. Exactly. That's have been our mantra all of our life. Kaya nga sabi ng mga ibang countries, foreigner, you know, Filipinos, dami ng turbulence o death alam mo naglalaro pa rin ng basketball may baha tumatawa pa rin nagiinuman sa gilid alam mo yon we always find ways to make life easier and happy happy smile pa rin kahit na <laughs> dami problema na, na, ganun talaga eh. <laughs> imagine mo si ARQ uh, boxing stable oh. ng Odette pero patuloy pa rin delay telecast lang imagine galing, that galing, galing. diba oh. it's nag one year na almost one year ngayon congratulations 8 na to no? yep Credit to our, of course, our promoter and our uh, CEO, Jason Arquisola, for again. It looks like providing, is... providing some, uh, you know, livelihood. Of course, amen, amen, amen. And by the way, that's what we're going to do. You know, unless anything else on the third round, maybe a few times A UT for Antaran, or for, I'm so sorry, for Makati Yeah, he's The little giant himself. Ano tawag sa term na yun eh. Yung parang contradicting little tas giant. Oo. Little, literally maliit, but giant when he fought in the ring. Yes, sir. That's up next for you guys. Three minutes of co-main event left. Makado looking to cruise to a victory. One thing that I would like to add again, ano, sabi nga nila ngayon, mas mabenta na yung magsalita ka na lang tapos sa laban ano parang mga uh, alam mo na magaling magsalita <laughs> pagdating sa laban wala so, oh, wala pero pwede naman yata may, may swag naman kasi mga ano <laughs> last round scheduled for 10 our co-main event and again Espinas versus Gabonillas on our main event the former OPB or the former Philippine flyweight champion Jesse Little Giant Espinas yeah, Versus our current OPBF Youth Flyweight Champion. That's up next, right? Yep, Chan Paul. Gabonillas ang angas ng Cebu. Makado, itong uh, ganitong classic fighter. Uh, it's good na nasa air cue siya dahil magpapromote kayo lagi. Pero ito yung kasi patingin ko, mga, ito yung mga iiwasan na fight. Ihirap kasi talunin na yung mga ganito. <laughs> Ihirap talunin ang galing eh. So fundamentally sound, he knows what he needs to do. Counter. Lalo na pag makadevelop ito ng power. Oo. Good body punch there that time for Antaran. Oh, yun na. Yun na. Nag-showboat na. Ayan na. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Bigyan mo na. Round number 10, Makado. Come on. Let's do this. 
Huwag ka lang magpanakaw. Siyempre, pero kahit matalo ka sa round na to. Again, another pan- ball of punch. Ayan na, ibigay mo na. Let's go, one minute and a half. Let's go. Tingnan natin, baka kung gugustuhin mo pala makanakaw. Dito na. No, pwede na. Patipensahin mo naman si Antara. Hindi ko wala lagi eh. Ayan na, ayan na. Mukhang, mukhang yan ang gagawin niya. Mukhang susubukan, no? Kita mo, a little bit of hesitation. He has been reactive kasi all throughout eh. Reactive meaning is just uh, act, uh, activating based on the attack of Antaran. And right now, maybe let's see if he's the one pushing. And then the wild shot again of Antaran. Nothing's happened here. Wala, talagang wala eh. Kulang sa ano eh. And uh, Ito na guys Main, ano na, main event na Oo, malapit na <laughs> What exchange there uh-huh, yeah, Antaran uh-huh. Shouting <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have a unanimous decision as our judges scored about Edward Ligas, 100 to 90, Neil Papas, 97-93, Noel Flores, 98-92, for your winner, Ramel Macado Jr. And that's it, a win here. For Main Ramel event is coming Mercado up next. Hang out. Junior, that is his fifth win. Five out of